Good morning, Jesse Clark. It is Monday, February 6th. It is National Frozen Yogurt Day. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. The weather today after school will be 54 degrees and partly cloudy. Tomorrow morning at the bus stop is 42 degrees, cloudy and windy. For lunch today, you have a choice of a chicken sandwich or a sloppy joe sandwich. Those come with potato wedges, broccoli, and a choice of fruit. If you're not interested in potato wedges, if you're not interested in chicken sandwich or a sloppy joe sandwich, you can get a yogurt and cheese plate, or a chef salad. For lunch tomorrow, you have a choice of nachos or a chicken fajita flatbread. Those come with refried beans, a cookie, and a choice of fruit. If you're not interested in nachos or a fajita flatbread, you can get a PB&J Uncrushable or a chef salad. FFA week is approaching quickly. This year's service project is helping pause for the cause we are taking donations as well as making dog toys and treats at the February FFA meeting. If you'd like to donate to this great cause, bring donations to Mrs. Bentley's room by February 23rd. You can see a list of needed items here. We appreciate, uh, we appreciate anything that you can donate. Wildlife meets this Friday at 7.45 a.m. in Ms. Merrick's room. Hope to see you there. The JCMS Valentine's Dance is Friday, February 10th. Here's some more info you might need. Hey Eagles, it's that time again when we get ready to celebrate all things love with our Valentine's Day dance, which will be held on February 10th. Tickets are $5. You can purchase those in the front hall in the morning starting on February 6th. You may purchase tickets at the door Please remember that lost tickets will not be replaced. You'll have to buy another one. And also, only Jesse Clark Eagles can attend. So what to wear for this dance? School appropriate semi-formal wear is suggested but not required. Peep the picture below. So if you look at some of the semi-formal guidelines, you can wear a dress or a pantsuit or a jumpsuit. Um, you could also wear a blazer and dress pants. Just dress it up just a little bit more than usual. Not necessary, but we sure would like to see it. Snacks that we're gonna have, we'll have pizza again for $2 a slice, Chick-fil-A sandwiches for $6, candy for $2 per item, chips for $1 per item, and drinks for $1 per item. Please remember that small bills are better. And lastly, don't forget, doors open at 5.30 p.m. Your ride must be here before 7.30 p.m. Please make plans before you come. Late pickups may be banned from other school dances and events. If you have any other questions, just let us know, and we hope to see you on February 10th for the Valentine's Day dance. Hey, e Jesse Clark archery team took first place at the tournament this week. Our team leading scores were George. Wilson Rickert, Lily Riggs, Corbin Brown, Gavin Simpson, Emerson O'Brien, Lincoln Payton, Samantha Martin, Lucas Delcher, Hannah Hunt, Merrick Mitchell, Maddie Bottoms, and Sophia Reckel -Ho Raquel Hoff. George Wilson Rickert was awarded a medal for third overall boy, and Lily Riggs awarded fourth overall girl for the entire middle school division. Way to shoot, Eagles. 2023 Lafayette softball tryouts are happening soon. Tryouts are open to grade 7 through 12. Tryouts will be held at the Green Building at Lafayette High School on Monday, February 13th from 7.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. You need to bring your own softball equipment, a water bottle, and practice clothes. And you want trying out must have a copy of their KHSAA sports physical. 
Tonight, JCMS Boys Basketball hosts Beaumont in a huge rivalry game at 5.30 p.m. Come cheer on our boys and fill up the student section like you did last week. Tonight's student section theme is wide out. Go Eagles! JCMS next week is Random Acts of Kindness Week. Get ready to participate each day of the week. One day we plan to focus on taking care of our community. We are asking for donations for a local nonprofit, The Nest. The Nest is a safe healing place for education, counseling, advocacy, and support for Lexington families. Please bring donations to your pod area where a box will be located with signs for donations. We are going to be collecting toiletry items and baby diapers. All items must be purchased, new and unopened. Let's participate in random acts of kindness by reaching out and taking care of our families in our community. Credit to Ma Mara Schulte, Sophie Mintu, and Jolie Jones for creating the flyers for this event. Students, please stand. Teachers, please check that all students have their badge and Chromebook and that all students are in dress code. Students, at this time, please check that your phone is turned off and stored in your locker, your backpack, or your pocket. And remember, here at Jesse Clark, our school-wide expectations are value self, value others, and value learning. Every person, every day. Have a great Monday, Jesse Clark.